What do you make of this announcement? What do you make of the W2 approval of these tariffs? Uh, do they have a point about subsidies to Airbus? Well, um, look, the first thing I'm going to say is uh, just to quote one of the chefs um, who I understand owns a lot of restaurants in the U.S. Um, and, and he said, uh, you know, if you're a deal maker, and obviously he was talking about Donald Trump, then negotiate with allies first, make deals with allies first before you do that with enemies. Um, so essentially, um, you know, you know, the, the main thing to, to watch out for is indeed, as you said, is this what we want? Uh, the, the EU so far has reacted by uh, saying on the one hand, on behalf of the European Commission, Commissioner Malmström uh, for trade was saying imposing, uh, imposing tariffs now to retaliate would be, would be silly. Uh, on the other hand, different member states that are being hurt are actually considering retaliation. Uh, so this is, I think, the, the, the first thing that I would like to, to highlight. Um, other than that, you know, I mean, yeah, I, I guess the WTO uh, does have a point. I'm, I'm um, in no position to judge uh, the, the actual verdict itself. Um, but the, the EU has been saying, uh, on the other hand, that Boeing was enjoying similar, um, similar facilities. So that it wouldn't necessarily be fair uh, that now the U.S. is retaliating in response to uh, the EU subsidizing Airbus. Uh, so, you know, I, I, I am, uh, the one thing um, I, I guess to, uh, to take away is um, legally and, and from the point of view of who's right and who's wrong, um, both sides or alternatively um, one or the other might be but the thing is, this is political. This is not just. Uh, this is not just about trade. This is not just about legal terms. This